My involvement with the septic tank elimination program, um, which we call STEP, um, started approximately three years ago when I became a manager of the group. When Citizens was evaluating um, options to move away from gravity for our septic tank elimination projects, and we were looking at various alternatives, um, life cycle cost was uh, a big consideration. And uh, E1 was able to provide some case studies where they had looked at what those costs were. And so that was key for us um, in our evaluation. One of the nice things about the program uh, that we discovered was that I think it was around $2,500 to $3,000 was the total bill for the homeowner. The rest of it was uh, part of the uh, city, city and state expansion. And uh, you could break that up over without interest over a number of years, and it's uh, simply uh, the best value on, on offer at that point. It's, it's a no-brains deal. One of the true benefits of the, of the STEP program as it is right now is the cost efficiency of the program. So um, by switching the program from a gravity design system to an all-terrain system with grinder pumps has really allowed us to expand the program and connect a lot more people um, because of the cost of efficiency uh, of the program. I was quite impressed uh, with the fact that they have a system that could come into neighborhoods like this, which had not been uh, able to afford the type of systems, or maybe perhaps have the, not have the geographical terrain that could put the larger systems in. Geotech-wise, really the main issues we've come across are more of a pit run, cobblestones, um, and that's kind of what we find along the White River where a lot of these neighborhoods are. The way that we you know, build step now is all horizontal directional drill. Um, usually we can stay you know, out of the roadway, um, do everything within the right of way, uh, but in the dirt, you know, um, putting main lines in, um, which allows for our um, lateral connections to also be you know, within the pavement. We, and, and then we directional drill all those laterals under the pavement to you know, homes that are you know, on the opposite side of the road. We, we can directional drill you know, a three or four inch low pressure main, you know, 800 to 1,000 feet in a day, whereas if it was going to be a gravity um, installation, um, you know, 15, 20 foot deep, uh, you might be looking at a 80 or 100 feet a day. Actually, one of the first low pressure projects to go through the city I was a part of, and it went through a very well-to-do neighborhood and everything went seamlessly. And um, the disruption part of it for the neighborhood and for the environment was greatly reduced. I think one of the true benefits of the septic tank elimination program and the ability to use all-terrain sewers and grinder pumps is the uh, environmental impact it'll have on residents in central Indiana. Uh, by being able to eliminate um, failing septic systems and get people affordably connected to the public sewer system, it will have a great impact on the health and well-being of the community. We're a known entity of correcting septic tank issues, uh, allowing builders and developers to uh, utilize land in a different fashion to grow their business also. But the, the, the real future is correcting major aging infrastructure issues um, by using pressure sewer to replace failed gravity. There's, there's literally millions of houses co connected to gravity systems that are failed. Uh, and the utilities have to fight this every day. Um, we have an answer. We can do that with uh, all-terrain sewer.